Hello fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's Saturday the 15th of April 2023. I hope you are keeping well. Uh, this is the last day of our new year. I'm not sure if I'm going to be celebrating today. Looks like I might have to take the cat to the hospital. Oh dear. If it's open, that is. I'm not even sure if it's open today. Anyway, I'll find out later. Um, what's happening in US news? I see the Supreme Court has put a stay on a lower uh, appeals court um, um, ruling that um, limited uh, the uh, a a abortion drug or after <laughs> we'll call it a brush of drug for now um, uh, in in some cases I think the Supreme Court is starting to get a bit nervous I mean most of those or many of those judges were put there for the sole purpose of getting rid of abortion that's been the Federalist uh, plan Federalist Society plan for many years right uh, and now they've found out that actually People don't want to get rid of abortion. And now with the other scandals uh, appearing with Clarence Thomas uh, and other problems that have been that have shown the, the, the U.S. Uh, Supreme Court to be a bunch of political hacks, really, over the last few years, um, I think they're starting to get a bit nervous and maybe they're worried and saying, hey, we could be in real trouble here. We might lose some of our ex extreme power, the extreme power that we hold. <laughs> what do you reckon? It's possible anyway. Uh, okay, this is the Guardian um, expert level puzzle. It's a Saturday, isn't it? It's uh, difficult to know what day of the week it is when you're on a long holiday like this. It's Saturday, so it should, I forgot to check, but I guess it's the expert level puzzle. Um, so I won't bother to explain the rules. I'll just get started. And I see sevens blocking across here. That gives me a seven there. And I see threes blocking up and down here and across there, which gives me a three there. That's the two things that I noticed whilst chatting to you. Uh, anything else we can do on these threes? Yes, there certainly is. We can get the threes going up here. So we'll place a three there. Then we have three across here and across here. That will give me a three like so. I think that's as far as we can take the threes because I guess we'll end up with threes in those squares. Now, what was the other number I placed? A seven. Anything else we can do with the sevens? Um, not sure. Okay. Um, now what looks like it might be worth investigating across here we are missing one five eight in this block what about this block uh, we have ones here we have okay four blocks across here and four blocks across here so that's another easy number we can start with um, Uh, okay, looks like one, five, and eight are missing here, and we have one and five in these squares, so that's got to be an eight. And of course, that's going to put eight over here now. Um, yeah, one, five, obviously, one, five, so one, five, like that. Okay. Uh, all right, let's hang on to that eight and see if there's anything else. Indeed, there was something. Eight's going up here like this, so that will give me an eight there. And what about these fours? Anything good with those? Yes, four blocks down here and four blocks across here, so we get four in one of those squares. Blocking back that way, four down here puts a four into that square. We have, no we don't, <laughs> forget that thought, we have, we do have six blocking up here and down, down and up in those rows.
what's lacking in this column? We're looking for two and we are looking for seven. Okay, so if those squares are two and seven, we will be left with uh, eight and something. Two and seven, so eight and nine. Okay, so we have the nine blocking here. That will be our nine and this will be our eight. nine blocks across here and across here so that will give us a nine in that square missing digits here are five seven nine and we have five and nine in the same row so that's got to be a seven And on this side, looks like we're missing two, four, eight, right? Because this is five and nine. So two, four and eight here. And we've got the two and the eight in the same row. So that's got to be a four. Now we have four blocking down here and up here and across here. So here's our four, then four across and across here. And down here gives me a four. And that's where four is blocking to the bottom means that's a four. That's the final digit four actually. We have six across this row and across this row, so that has to be a six there. Six blocks this way, so six is in one of these two squares, blocking back in this direction. And then we have sixes blocking down there, so that has to be a six. Uh, eight blocks this square but in this row we don't yet have eight so that's the only place where the eight can go and to finish this row a two will suffice we also have two blocking down here that's going to put two into that square there sure what we need now okay let's just try clicking on the digits and see if anything springs to mind yeah one blocks this square and nine blocks this square so we have one and nine in those squares this then has to be seven for this block seven then across this row and down here gives us seven there and now seven blocking this square seven blocking this square so in this row that's the seven
Okay, one of our missing digits here is 9. That blocks across here, and that's going to give us a 9 in that square. And the last number to place here is a 5. Uh, we know this is 1 and 9, right? So this square here is neither 1 nor 9. It must be a 3. 3 blocks down here, down here, and across these two rows. It's going to put a 3 in that square. One blocks across here, that gives us a one in that square. Uh, one of the missing numbers here is two blocking that way, so that must be our two, and that's going to put the two at the end here. We also know that two blocks up here, up here, and across there, so we'll fit a two there. And now the last number to place down here is a seven. So seven across here, seven down here, here's our seven. The end number here is a one. Uh, nine blocks across here and up here so that will give us a nine in that square and now we have one blocking up here and up here so that's our digit one one then blocking across here giving us a one here one blocking across here and up here means that that's a one and then one down here final one there nine is in this square here and then nines blocking up and up give us the final digit nine there The last number to place here is a 5, that means this can't be 5, so that must be 5, that blocks down here giving us a 5 there, 5 blocks down here giving us a 5 there, we still need an 8 here, we still need an 8 there and an 8 there, <laughs> got rid of those 8s pretty quickly. Uh, one number left for this row, um, I think it's a 6, and then the 6 blocks down here, that will give me a 6 there. The last number here is a 2, 2 blocks up here, here's our 2, and to finish our expert level game, a 5 will do it, that's it, thank you very much, that's our Guardian game for Saturday, see you at other times during the weekend, bye bye.